Caution. Hexavalent chromium compounds are toxic, dangerous for the environment, and known carcinogens or mutagens. Experiments must be performed in a fume hood and need to be kept in small scale. Hello and welcome to another chemistry video. Today I want to show you the decomposition of ammonium dichromate, also well known as the dichromate volcano. For this purpose, some fine powdered ammonium dichromate is placed onto a hardly combustible surface. I use the lid of a crucible. To start a decomposition reaction, a few drops of acetone are added to the top of the pile and lighted with a Bunsen burner. The decomposition reaction starts immediately and leaves a fluffy residue of other chromium compounds like chromium oxides, chromium chromate and some residues of ammonium dichromate. This residue is essential for the next experiment, the Firefly experiment. For the best visibility, I'm using a 1 liter Elmer flask. First, I poured in some ammonia solution, which slowly gives off gaseous ammonia. The ammonia itself won't react with the airborne oxygen, but in presence of a catalyst, here I'm using the hot chromium oxide particles, a directly combustion of the ammonia takes place. During the second trial, you can see the Elmer flask is a bit foggy from the inside. This is due to the reaction product of the combustion of ammonia. It's simply nitrogen and some water. So, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, and if you want, Subscribe to my channel.